Greetings, welcome back to Empty Cloak Gaming. My name is Cloak, and today we'll pick up on our Hitman Let's Play with the murder of crows. Hee 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 hee. So you didn't get it? It was quite a blow. That witness possessed information about the Ortmeier files or their location. Ortmeier files? Dr. Ortmeier ran an underground cloning lab in Romania. We raided it as soon as we learned about it, but someone beat us to it. They'd ransacked the place, grabbed all the files, and killed everyone that worked there, even Ortmeier. But that was the least of our concerns. What do you mean? We did find some papers later. Enough to prove that Dr. Ortmeier created Mr. 47. No one else has successfully created a Class I human clone. Dr. Ortmeier literally wrote the book. And somebody stole it. Not just somebody. Where's the nurse? Whoa. Sorry. I... I don't like being dependent. Something as simple as lighting a damn cigar, it's just... Irritating? I apologize. Could you... Of course. So, who stole the research? We found a surveillance tape. It clearly showed Mr. 47 killing the guards and snapping poor Dr. Ortmeier's neck. So 47 wanted to build his own clones? More likely, he wanted to sell the research to the highest bidder. It lit a fire under everyone's asses. We threw everything we had at him. It's all there. Hmm, syringe? Box of stuff. Hello, 47. The American Secretary of the Interior is being Okay, murder of crows. Today's Mardi Gras parade. So we get to kill a bunch of uh, people dressed up as birds. Wants you to prevent it by taking out the yeah, 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 yeah. Start the mission. And here they are. The three birds on the slate. In this episode, we are a counter-assassin. The three crows are playing to assassinate a politician. The crow in red there... Well, he's the delivery man. He has the payment briefcase, which we're going to steal. If we steal that payment briefcase, we can actually put the assassination on hold. There's the handoff. Follow that briefcase, 47. It's the only lead we've got. Okay, prep a syringe. Because I gotta sedate the red bird and take the payment briefcase from him. Now, the targets. The only one that appears on the map right now is the boss target, because he's in one location the entire time. However, the trigger man can appear in one of three random locations. The easiest way to find out where he is, is take out his girlfriend who wanders the streets in some strange pattern. She has a walkie-talkie. Once you kill her, you can take the walkie-talkie off her, and then you'll know where he is. He being the trigger man. This guy, though, is the payment briefcase, as I said before. If we take the payment briefcase, we can actually put a freeze on the assassination. It's actually relatively difficult to grab that payment briefcase, though. It takes a lot of patience, and I frankly don't have those patience. Oh, well, he's going to go in here. He's going to loop around the block and go in here. But um, getting a hold of him is actually pretty difficult. He's a bit of a nuisance to catch. He will run to the police in a heartbeat. He's super suspicious. 
just turning probably. He's, he's still looking at me. Got him. Hopefully. Good night. Okay. Let's throw you in the dumpster here. Enjoy your night in the dumpster, Doom. Now, as I was saying, we we're actually here to play Counter Assassin. We're here to prevent that politician from that side panel from being killed. And you have to acquire this payment briefcase to put the assassination on a freeze. But now that I have it locked down, I can go about the next part of the job, which is simply learning where the assassin is. To uh, learn where the trigger man is, you need to take out this girl here. His girlfriend. And the easiest way to do that is with a designated death trap set up in the back alley around the corner here. Right here. You see the, uh, see the piano hanging there? We're gonna rig that to fall on her. <laughs> so let's do a little bit of Hitman parkour here. Anyway, you have to take her out to get a hold of her walkie-talkie, because you can only learn where the trigger man is by using the walkie-talkie. The other thing we want to take off her when she dies is her gun, because we're going to need that to uh, probably kill the trigger man. It's usually not the easiest job. But from experience, getting hold of the bag man is only the uh, first part of a relatively difficult um, step series of operations. This part's simple, because all I gotta do is climb down and wait for uh, the crow lady to show up. She does like to take her sweet time, though. But after we have the walkie-talkie, we'll learn which of the uh, three bars the trigger man's hiding in. And we'll simply go acquire a waiter's outfit and get him. Right now, it's a matter of waiting for the uh, girl to show up and stand underneath our piano. Lady, if you're any slower, I would grow mold. Would you kindly walk to your death, please? Just get under the piano. I mean, musical demise. You good? Good. Gentlemen, run! Musical death! Oh, good gracious. Alright, where's your crap? Cop? Where's the walkie-talkie? You want to grab the gun with the cop here. Where's your walkie-talkie? That's the gun. Where's the walkie? Uh-oh. Well, that backfired horrifically. If I can't get the walkie-talkie, then I have to go do this the hard way, which means acquiring a waiter outfit and go to every single bar and hope I find the bastard. Shit. Well, let's hope we get lucky then. That backfired horrifically. Well, only one thing to do. 
Wait for a poor unfortunate soul and uh, take him hostage again. Although I do believe in the hotel up here, there's actually a uh, waiter costume across the street. Oh, wait, here comes a walking suit. This might pay off. Please, sir, don't make me kill you. I, I just need your clothes for the evening. I mean, you could sleep it off nice and peacefully in this dumpster of doom here. All you gotta do is turn around, let me trank you, put you under. You could sleep it off nice and peacefully. And nothing really horrible has to happen to you. Alternatively, you could be a pain in my ass, and I could blow your head off. What? Excuse me. Look, you're asking for it. Shut up! Unfortunately, the game didn't give me much choice. I have to go to door to door in every single bar to make sure the man's not there. Enjoy the dumpster. Damn it. Yeah, okay. Hello. Might as well start with this bar. Now, you need waiter outfits because every bar happens to have its own uniform, except for waiters. Because waiter's universal. Yeah, go kiss up to her elsewhere. This is a restaurant. Not a brothel. I should be prepping the gun. Because if I find him, he's going to want to fight me. Oh, shit. Well, he's dead. Let's let it cool down here for a bit. Because the cops have heard that gun. <laughs> well, okay. That was unfortunate. Found him in the first bar. Yep, the doors are open. The cops ran in. What the hell? Why is there a pigeon? Hey! Pigeons! Well, the good news is, I know where the last guy is. The bad news is, I have no idea how to get to him without that suit Mr. Raven had on. And he just got his brains splattered, and the room is loaded with the cops! Very peculiar position I'm in now. Oh well. Might have to get creative. Okay. So how am I going to get to that guy? Usually I would ha I would bring a sniper rifle and just snipe him from across the way here. But I'd do that. Huh. This is going to get hard. They won't let me in unless I'm, wear I'm wearing a crow suit. And the only place to acquire a crow suit is off the dead body. Now, there is a crow sleeping in the hotel. So apparently that was such a screw-up that the only way to fix it is to cause more screw-ups. Crap. Oh, hey, they're leaving. Good. If they're leaving, I can get to the corpse. Hello, officer. I'm just here for the boxes. Oh, good... Ah, oh, don't pull them out. No! Alright, where are you taking the body? What the heck? What the... <laughs> <coughs> okay, that was a pretty funny glitch. Yeah, go ahead, grab the corpse and try again. I'm glad it didn't happen to me. Maybe 
Maybe they'll put the corpse somewhere convenient. I doubt it, but it's worth a shot. If they don't, I'm going to have to make a bigger mess to fix this one. He's going to take it all the way to the guard station. Well, that's unfortunate. Personally, I would have wished he would have left it in the back up there where no one saw it. The guard station's in the middle of the street. It's about here. Well, alright. Improvise. That went horrible. That was by far not the best thing that could have happened. Okay, one of these rooms has a crow then. There he is. Did you come out here for a minute, please? I need to talk to you. Come here. You're my only option. Why are you so trigger happy? Jeez. Alright, you know what? Screw it. No, I... Police. Better get out. Okay, if I'm going to make noise doing this, I might as well really earn the noise. So, I can't see any way around it. This is going to turn into a gunfight regardless of what I do. If it's unavoidable. So we didn't see his friend. He did. All I need is one. Make sure no one finds the cor this corpse. Make my life a little easier. Still have a couple bullets left, okay. But now I can gain entry. Yep, this is gonna be a body count. Problem is, I don't have any body armor. Remember, I can't upgrade. So I am vulnerable. There's the boss. There's a fellow crow. Okay, I'm gonna walk right here and wait for you to leave the room. Then I'm gonna blow the boss's head off. Or maybe I'll just stand by and look pretty. I don't know. I guess I'm not bothered either way. Getting out is probably the better plan anyway. I was almost certainly witnessed. If 
You just buy the window, you shoot him, someone's gonna see it. It's hard not to get witnesses sometimes. The faster I get back in my suit, the happier I'm gonna be. Wait for this guy to leave, though. A lot of drunks in uh, New Orleans around Mardi Gras. Very accurate statement. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Kind of like Twitter, but less fun. Okay. So now I just got to grab my payment briefcase and I'm done. This should be the easy part. I mean, after all, they should theoretically be looking for waiters and birds. Not icky hitmen. I accept whatever a rating it gave me. I knew I was pretty much doomed when the walkie-talkie ended up untouchable. Because the gamble was too much. No, no witnesses. Cover blown. Yes, it was. Four bodies. Yeah, it had to leave corpses. But let's find out. Contract killer. Okay, so it's not the worst it could have been. I was thinking I was going to beeline right into Deranged Slayer the way it was going. Massive murder. Noise, yeah, because I had to disarm the guy. No notoriety scored, though. That's something. Contract killer kills again. Amazed how that played out. Got really lucky. There you have it. A relatively messy murder of crows brought on by some serious mistakes. But... I guess it'll work. So anyway, I've been Cloak. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you next time.